Cross play. I know. I just I need to work on my body, man. I need to get this taken care of. But alas, uh, if you're interested in cosplaying, you just happen to be watching the Smash stream. Uh, we do have a cosplay contest That's here going cool. on. That's uh, super cool. So if you want to show off your your moves, you want to show off your cosplaying, just how clean you are. Come out. Oh, poor Thunders. Thunders is another uh, oh. Tennessee player, actually. I believe. No, no. Thunders is. Alabama. Is Alabama. I knew he was okay. out of state. I, I, I saw him at KIT. He made top eight there. Um, this, this is bad. This is, is bad. Uh, this is bad. When even like when even when even on the top level, like Larry can just yeah, just absolutely explode. Get body bag. Yeah, just by Bayo. Like the, the the bag itself has sand coming out of it, man. It's not even a punching bag anymore, man. It's just this is the bag. Like it's it's okay for for those of you that have not watched this matchup. Um, it's pretty free, Fox. especially especially like compared to the, of the top tiers. Yeah, this like is top tier versus top tier. This is probably the worst matchup. I yeah I I, I can't say except I can't for think maybe of except anymore. for Rosa Cloud. Yes, Rosa, Rosa Cloud. Rosa, Rosa Cloud is pretty bad. Yeah, um, Meta, yeah, Meta, but not but Meta not Knight. not this bad. Yeah, it's not it's not. Meta Knight's not top tier. Yeah, he's not top tier. Meta, Meta, like Meta top is like tier. high mid tier, maybe low top tier. Yeah, but this matchup in particular is just it's so break it down for him. Why is this matchup bad? <laughs> okay, now as you know, Fox. Probably, I believe, the fastest faller in the game. I Bayo, believe that's right. As you have seen her witch twist and her side Bs, long story short, combo to hold him back. Yes. Um, if Against you the seen, cast. You, 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 you've probably heard of the setup, but up B to forward air to up B. Is this matchup, in a nutshell, if you get caught off stage, now, it's the, not The pretty. important thing about the up B is it's got set knockback. Yes, um, and that's very important for combos in general. But it just it leaves Fox at such a bad position. Oh yeah, like you can smash the eye out of it to some extent, but it's extremely hard to do with Fox. And even then, if Fox is ever ever off stage, Bayo has the freest time, just which timing, anything he does, and for practically free. And to further complicate this matchup for Thunders is the fact that if he's off stage and gets caught by fair one, he's dead. Yeah, at you drop like zero percent. Fair one, fair one, fair one, fair one, goodbye. Oh, yeah. But as we say this, we see another Excuse star. Excuse me, fair one fair, fair one, fair two. Fair one, fair two. Oh, yeah, fair one, fair two. As we say this, um, Thunder's actually doing a solid job for himself, uh, getting in the uppers where he needs to. So as, while we were saying that, the neutral for Fox isn't actually that bad. No, like Fox, Not at all. Fox is probably the closest definition to a glass cannon that, that there is in Smash 4. I believe him and Mewtwo are the two main cannons. Oh, yeah, absolutely. <laughs> Whoa, call out Fort Smash there. So, again, this, the neutral isn't terrible for Fox. He can get the hits in where he needs to. He's fast enough to weave around Bayo's aerials and the challenger when he needs to. The call out on that jump with the down air there was really clean, too. Gets an immediate chunky percent with down air into up air. Oh, yeah. It's just when you get off stage as Fox, it's absolutely horrifying. But on stage, as you can see here, it's, 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 cool. it's doable. All right. And, and Gaddy will throw out maybe the, the Hail Mary witch time there. Oh, yeah. Thunder's just solid in control. And th th yeah, that's just death. Wow, Thunder just beat the brakes off of Gaddy on game one. <laughs> beat the brakes off of our uh, little matchup analysis we had earlier. Thanks, buddy. <laughs> but no, good for him, though. Like This is like this is an extremely difficult matchup. He clearly has practiced and trained against this. Oh, you yeah, know, It's not something like if you're going to play on a top level, you have to understand your bad matchups. You, you, and he clearly knows this matchup extremely well. Only taking 68% that entire game, safely held shield, knew when to punish Bayo, which isn't the easiest thing in the world, oh, no matter what your skill level is. And uh, he really worked circles around her, using the like the like just the pure frame data advantage that Vox has. Oh, oh, completely. And you, Bayo is just one of those matchups you have to know. Probably the most prominent, one of the most prominent characters in the game. Um, in my opinion, the best character in the game will possibly tied uh, with Sheik. You think Sheik's number two? I think she could be. Really? I think potentially she still she still could be number two. I see a lot of people having Sheik at number three. Um, I don't I don't think Sheik's top five personally. Really? Uh, uh, Rosalina opinions. Rosalina <laughs> opinions. I, oh wait, yeah, you I'm, do. I'm, I'm I'm very I'm very like I'm in the very vocal minority. Like yeah. I I think Sheik's I think Sheik's nerfs are just too detrimental for her to continue to be top five. Okay. Granted, at a task level, which is you know not unattainable, Sheik's probably number one. Yeah, yeah, easily. Um, oh. As, as as people improve, I, I still think Mr. R and Void, you know, are capable of like maintaining her at a top level. Um, I just think she's got some real problems against top tiers. Oh yeah, she but, definitely does have those problems. But this game, we still have Bayo Fox. Um, we Thunders. a couple a couple of sets ago, we talked about the 
the gutsy stage pick with Mario on Town and City. Oh, this yeah. is a gutsy stage pick by Gadiel. Gadiel. Oh, He's yeah. Dead. Oh, that's, it's adding. He saved him. He, I think he did save him. He was definitely going to get clipped under there. Um, Gadiel probably not realizing that, but hey, he still got control of neutral, so he's getting protected. And he brought, this, he brought the damage all the way back, too. Like, Thunder's had a huge start. Oh, yeah. And now is at a 21% deficit. So as you were saying earlier, this is actually a very good season stage because honestly, this is arguably Fox's best stage. You know, the only other pick that's even close is Dreamland. I imagine. Mm, Gadiel not like this. Yeah, Gadiel round not three, round three game, back. gaming zone. Gadiel on possibly his winner side stock. Ooh, and just scouting out that grab there. It's just gonna put him in a Texas situation. So again, I, I want to point out what I was saying earlier with Bayo platform camping. She can do that against certain characters, i.e. Mario's not the best at dealing with her. Fox, completely different story. Um, yeah, the Fox, speed. Fox frustrates the hell out of me because of the fact that he can land on shield with aerials and he's still positive. Yeah, you, you're, not, you're not touching Fox afterwards. Fox falls way, way, way too fast to be punished for his up airs. Um, moves extremely fast, so Bayo can't really just side beat to the next platform without getting hit. Um, so this is a completely different story compared to Mario. Like, this is, again, not a stage I would take. Fox 2 ever? No. Unless I was like just had no choice. Maybe is Cloud. Maybe, maybe is Cloud. Maybe. Um, I still, I think the Beta Bleed Dreamland may be better. Yeah, of, for oh, yeah, sure, yeah. between the two of them. But either one, Tri Platform's super scary. Uh, Gadio, again, not really getting any opportunities to get the neutral starter that he wants to. And I don't feel like the platform layouts or the stage was the problem. I feel as if Thunders just had, has had a more solid control of neutral. And uh, Gadio's. Like, every single time, Gadiel has not been able to convert on Fox off stage, and that's really where you need to convert. Ooh, DBZ. Uh, DBZ trades, but he's, no, he's, he's alive, he's alive. Um, but again, I feel as if he's not really converting on Fox where he needs to off stage, and that, that honestly is one of Fox's few vulnerabilities as a character. Um, so every single time we've seen Thunders pretty much recover high or go for the ledge with side B, and Gadiel it's kind of neglecting to which time either of those. He's just falling underneath him yeah, he's and trying, trying to, to up the, He's trying to get the nares out, trying to get a couple different things. Oh, Honestly, yeah. I feel like on a top level, oh. oh. On, a, on a top level, anytime Fox is off stage, it sh he should be dead. Oh, yeah, absolutely. Like, it's just so exploitable. Yeah, he's just going to play patient and just up there through Gadios. Well, not through Gadios, but after Gadios.